This week's Color Rescue is about decorating up. What do you do with those huge cathedral ceilinged rooms with massive walls that go on and on? Do you put up some shelving and stick some art on that? Or do you treat the big box art kind of like wallpaper and coordinate it all together and install it on the wall? And that is what we're doing this week in my other cousin's home. So if you like this content, Subscribe below and let's get started. Hey, Hello. this is my fabulous cousin Mia and her husband Colin, and they are both physiotherapists here in Edmonton. And I'm here to add some throw pillows to the house. Come on in. <laughs> so Maria's sister Anita called and said, we're coming to town. Do you want us to check for your place? And at first I just said, no, because we were having guests and I just didn't want the house turned upside down. We were having people coming from out of town, we were having the baby shower and it was just too much right at this time. So we went over to my mom's house for dinner and Maria had just done a makeover there. When I saw what Maria had done over there, I said to Mia that we had to have her come over to our place. So I agreed, maybe just a few throw pillows for now. Sure, just a few throw pillows. I promise Mia, we would have this done by the end of the day. So my director of e-design and I, Trisha, picked her up, went to HomeSense. We didn't have time to go to two or three. Uh, so Maria and Trisha come and pick me up and we go to HomeSense and uh, they sit me down with my snack and those two are just shopping, having a great time. And uh, yeah, as I saw the pile starting to grow and seeing everything coming together, I was starting to get pretty pumped on how things were looking. People always also think that I'm at the best HomeSense, but really, it's that we know how to cherry pick accessories. So it's a good thing she was with me because we wrapped it up in a couple of hours and then we had three cars show up to bring it here. So three car loads later, uh, we get home, the family comes over and it turns into this big dinner decorating party. I didn't know what I was gonna be coming home to after the workday was done. So between dinner, the family, unpackaging everything, Oh, look at that. The wallpaper is going up. There is. Oh, I love it. Yay. My director of e-design, Trisha, and I were here hanging art, placing accessories. We finished by 9 p.m. just in time for Colin and Mia to come through the door. So when I pulled in from work, I was super happy to see Mia and was just ready to see the family and hang out and get on with the night. Um, but when I opened the door, it was a completely different place and my mind was blown <laughs> and everything looked amazing. So now I'm starting my maternity leave. The house looks beautiful and I can just relax and enjoy with the baby. I'm super excited that Mia's gonna have an unreal space to be in with our new baby mm -hmm. and having a place decorated for the weekend was fantastic. We hosted and everyone was overjoyed and super happy for us, so it was awesome. Yeah, so fun. Two years ago, we moved into our place and when we had moved in, it was black and white farmhouse and Mia and I didn't really know where to go with the decor or the decorating and so we had known and felt that we really wanted to put our, our stamp on it at some point but didn't really know where to start. It needed color. <laughs> we turned their trendy farmhouse black and white decor into classic and timeless with color. So when we were collecting and putting everything together in the store because this was a one day makeover don't forget that big heron Everybody loved that suddenly when they saw all the art that we added to it and Mia had to hang on to it <laughs> and protect it from being taken away because everyone wanted that bird art. So you have to think about the mix, do small and large, do the watery painting or the abstract painting so that it all kind of works together. Then when you, and you can do this online too, if you don't feel like you have the confidence to suddenly walk into a big box store and put together a collage of artwork like that, you can also do this online, again, using my shop online course, which will totally teach you in three short videos 
how to create mood boards to create a look and a feel because you can't get those colors to arrive and be correct if you don't have them all on a mood board to begin with. So that makes a huge difference. And you'll also, the other thing was this makeover was a little bit more expensive because we bought three counter stools for her kitchen, the travertine coffee table, two more end tables, the new rug. She needed more items to really pull that off. And then that was a big wall of artwork as well. But when you think about it, my take on spending a little bit of money to do this kind of makeover is so great to do because now you can sit back in your cozy house with all the lamps on in the winter time and just stop running around hoping to find those one or two objects, you know, at Home Goods or Home Sense that you think are gonna hopefully give you some magic. Do it all at once and then you can see how it all looks together, take back what doesn't work and have a space that you'll love forever. So I hope you enjoyed this color rescue. Please subscribe below and I'll see you next time.